Hello and welcome to episode 109 of Madhouse Militia Presents. We wish to give thanks to the following people for helping make the show go, such as Dwight the Janitor, Wasted Memory for RogueServer.com, where we broadcast our show every Friday night at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific, at RogueServer.com forward slash AKSPA, Dragomir for the Corndown at Corndown.com, which is the show that comes on right before our show at 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific, at Corndown.com as well as RogueServer.com. We also wish to give thanks to our patrons, such as Clues Ritz, our newest patron, Experts, Brian N., Mig Chungus, Jayad, Ryan T., Travis B., Gold Rust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3 Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Turbois, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts 666, Jesus Penus, and Turbo the High Level Squirrel. Thank you to everyone for helping support the show. The show is fully funded by the patrons, and that's how we make all the phone calls, that's how we produce the show, and that's how we pay for everything, is through all of the patrons and contributors to the show. I have to give thanks to everybody that shows up for the show every week as well, the listeners and everyone that wants to do calls. We do run it as an open show, and you can show up and and do calls with us. Just go to rogueserver.com forward slash AKSPA at 10 p.m. Eastern or 7 p.m. Pacific, and you'll find us in the mobile server waiting to do calls. You can find out more about us at immoralhole.com. You can find our old shows at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find the horsey cat at horseycat.com. You can find our Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash Madhouse Militia. You can find our YouTube at Madhouse Militia as well. That's Western Post. Well, well, well. Can I help you? Hi, Hello? yeah. Hi. Can we spin around in the room? Like, is there a chair we can sit on and just spin around a little bit? Do what, man? Yeah, we're, we're filming a movie in the room about office work and working remotely. Can we... Does our chair spin around like an office chair in the room? Yes. Hey. Oh, it let's does. Let's test it out right now. I'm going to have them test okay, it out. It'll be a really big show. Woo, 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 woo. Oh my Look how dizzy he is. Hello? Oh, God. I, I can't see straight now. Oh, my stomach. Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw up. Take it easy. We'll get you some Pepto Bismol. Oh, oh that stinks. Do what's that? Milk. He got what sick happened? all over the place. Ew. I vomited all over the bed. And it's really bad. Is there any way to me? get a maid to help us out, change the sheets? Yes, sir. Anybody could come up and change the sheets. He just barfed all over the place, and it's stinking. Okay, uh, what's yeah, the room number? I, 215. I had 215? Taco Bell. Yeah, I had Taco Bell, Chipotle, Burger King, McDonald's, and hot dog on a stick all, like, at once. And, yeah, it's not good. Okay, and what room did you say this was? 215. 215? Okay, I'll be right up. All right, thank you. We love you. Thank you, honey, baby. <laughs> Hello? Hi, hi. Do you have any rooms uh, vacant for tonight or no? Uh, I do. Uh, I mean, I I rent it by the whole okay, place. Okay, so. yeah, the, well, they're throwing us out of the pipeliner down the street here. They what? They're throwing us out. We're wondering if we could we could make it in there. Uh, yeah, I'm like, I, I mean, I I rent five rooms out. It's it's a, like a Airbnb. Oh, kind of a place. oh okay. It's not a hotel. Ah, oh, okay. So if I if I bring my whole family on here, let me let me just dial them in here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay, everybody. Hello. Hello. There Hello. We go. Hi. Perfect. Hey. That's that's three of us. Why are you using the phone? Oh, we need to all book a room. 
Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Okay. Why? Let's get Why one though? that has just two beds. Yeah, well, here, you talk to him. You talk to him. Why, though? Why Why do we need a room? I, I, I'm okay. I can sleep in the car. Uh, if we have full self-driving in our Tesla, uh, yeah, we well, just turn it on and we can go to sleep. I'm so tired of driving all night on Autobot. That darn Tesla is just crazy. Did you hear that? can get a room. Did you hear that bump and scream at about 3 a.m. this morning when the car was driving? I don't know. I don't know what that was, but there's all this red stuff all over the front of the hood and on the side of the car. I don't know what the heck. A hamburger or something. Yeah, we must have hit some fast food. Hi, I am a little bit intoxicated, and I may have done a little bit of drugs. I'm going to flip a Yui right now, and... Oh, that's a crazy sister. Oh, oh my gosh. No. Oh, I'll turn on the auto <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I lost my flip flop. Why is my phone ringing? Hi, is this OnStar? OnStar? Hello? No, this yeah, is Yeah, our OnStar. self-driving Tesla just ran over a bunch of fast food patrons. It's a mess. Shit! It's a mess, I mean, there's, there's cheeseburgers all over the place and on the hood and under the car. This ain't on the car, though. This is, this is Spring Hill Sweets. Yeah, oh. red stuff all over the windshield. Well, we're going to need somewhere to stay because our car is busted. Oh, no. Here we go again. Oh. 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 I don't know what you're talking Hello? Hello? Oh. This is right then. Shit! I gotta stop eating every refries. <laughs> <laughs> another, another satisfied Taco Bell customer. Hello? 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 Michael, how can I help you? How are you? Well, yeah, I'm looking for a very small room. Uh, I okay. want to save money. Okay. Um, we have single beds, but, I mean, they're the same price as the double beds, so. But this is the Microtel. I thought it would be, like, super small. Like. Well, I mean, they are the mic- smaller than your average hotel room, but we have no little tiny okay. ones. But I'm a I'm a little I'm a little man. I'm a I'm a, I'm a little I mean I got a cardboard box in the laundry much. room. Twenty bucks. Oh, you do that for me? Wow, you're the for best. Sure. So Will you come in and kick me in my eye when I'm sleeping and spit I'll on me and really tell me I'm worthless? To. I mean if that's what you're oh. into, I guess. But that's extra. I am. Right around 3.30 a.m. when I'm in the room closet in my cardboard box, come in there and boot me in the eye and kick me in the ass. All righty, I got you. What kind of box is it, though? Is it like an Amazon box? Is it a Home Depot no, it's box? it's a Frito-Lay box. box. It's pretty fancy, actually. Real sturdy. Oh, so it smells. Yeah, yeah. like corn chips. Wow, I, you know some people listen to the ocean and rain and mm-hmm. waves to fall asleep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm lulled to sleep. I, uh, food smells like uh, potato <laughs> chips, Taco Bell. Well, uh, oh, Taco Bell is my Taco number Bell. one sleep smell. I put a contract for under my pillow every night. Shit! 
That's crazy. <laughs> Everything that's been set up to this point has been acceptable, but that... <laughs> that was crazy. too much. Yeah, yeah, that's what they tell me. I'm crazy. So, this isn't a hotel for little people? It's not. I mean, we're equal opportunity. We'll take you big, small, tall. But the room Oh, I wish my ex would have size. done that. Yeah. That's what my ex said, that it was... She said it was a good size. What does that mean? <laughs> Hi there. I'm not mm-hmm. sure. Um, I have animals with me. Is mm-hmm. that okay? Uh, They're yeah, little they're animals, like though. And rats and you know, like guinea pigs. Bugs? No, I wouldn't do that. To you. Oh, is it a cow? Obviously, it, but it's a little cow. It's a little it's cow. Small cow. Oh. Is that the ones cow. they used to make the tiny little gallons of milk? No, that's stupid. It's the ones they used to make Hershey kisses. Jeez. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. You're right. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually uh, small enough to put in the palm of your hand. I, I had Are an you accident. Small enough to roll into a little ball? Um. Yes, <laughs> but I, I had I had a little accident in in the lab. I was trying to make my de- my parts down there bigger, mm-hmm. but I wound up shrinking my whole body. The, oh, the experiment failed. Yeah. Well, you know it happens to the best of us. Yeah, I mean we I. Can't all be scientists. I, well, I just wanted to be a scientist with a big wanker, but. Well, I think your cows are What's going on over there? Having issues. Yeah, but there's something else I have to confess, though. Like Okay, are you the Zodiac body, killer? No. See, like the rest yeah. of my body shrunk down to the size of a penny. But then mm-hmm. my pee-pee stayed four and a half inches, yeah. Oh, so my I'm, God. I'm so like, you're just all ween. Yep. <laughs> That's unfortunate for somebody, I'm sure. I'm some some people might be into that. There's someone yeah, for everyone. You know That's what they say, right? Yeah. Yeah, can you uh, get in contact with me if you find anybody who's interested in a penny-sized man with a four-inch penis? I hear Craigslist is a great way. Really? Okay. I thought I thought that was the place where you try to sell an old bike and you show up in the Home Depot parking lot. (laughs) Is that a tiny chicken? Yeah, it's a very small chicken. (laughs) The colonel is considering opening a little people KFC, so mm-hmm. he needs a little chicken. That makes sense. Because I'm a scientist. I make all kinds of things. Uh, <laughs> okay, small man, yeah, I really so, do have work to do. It's been lovely talking to you, but if you're not going to make a reservation for is it a room or your cardboard box... Is it a, you have a big... Do you have a big job to do or a little job to do? I am a big person. Unfortunately, I haven't been shrunk in a lab. So I have big responsibilities, oh. big jobs. You're a big deal, you know? I. That's what they tell me. Okay. Well, don't step on me on accident when I go by the hotel, okay? Okay, just make a lot of noise so I know you're there. Bring the cow. All right. Yeah, I got to take care of my animals. Mm-hmm. You sound like a very good farmer. Yeah. I'm... Oh, oh, see God! Yeah, I, I have some strange animals on the farm. I have a... That's all part of the lab accident. I have a horse 
uh, cat. Oh no, they were more involved cat. in the accident. This is this is getting worse. Yeah, so oh, there's Oh see God Yeah, it's a it's a it's got the body of the of a horse and the and the head of a cat. Uh really well weird. that sounds adorable. Does it? Hmm. It does. Gives me nightmares. I don't know. Meow. All right. Well, I got more science to do. Okay. So, yeah, you could do your big people job, and I'll go. I'll go do science. Do your little people job. Oh, okay. But she said. Yeah, a hundred percent. I agree. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, Who the fuck are Charlie Brown's parents? Okay. Have a lovely night, scientists. Good vibe. All right, all right. You're no help. No. Stripped and removed. Breasted mask. Hi, uh, do you have a Muppets for sale? Excuse me? You got a Muppets to eat? Okay. Right, Rusty Muskets, how does he help you? This is Kermit the Frog here. Would you like to eat me? Yes, I would. You're a sick... <laughs> Rusted mascot. Kermit the uh, Frog here. Have I gotten any calls? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi, Kermit the uh, Frog here. Um, have I gotten any phone calls? I'm sorry, you've got the wrong number. I'm Kermit the Frog. Is this Miss Piggy? Hi. Yeah, I'm bouncing around from place to place, and uh, I was wondering if I could bounce around in a room over there tonight. What? I w- I'm just bouncing around. I'm in a bubble, a ball. But I got money, so... I was hey, wondering if I could hotel. stay there. Yeah, this I know. I was wondering about a room. Yeah. Yeah, the smoking, not smoking. Well, no, you not smoking. Yeah, no, I'm not, not smoking or anything. No. You're looking for one bed, two bed. Oh, uh, one bed, uh, two men. Non-smoking. One bed? Smoking. Yeah, one bed. No, no smoke. non, non, no smoke. No. Okay, sixty nine ninety nine plus tax, and we do require the fifty dollar deposit. Oh, so it's a hundred nine up front. Six sixty nine ninety nine plus tax, and we, we do, do require the fifty dollar deposit. Okay, it's okay if we do sixty nine. Sixty nine ninety nine plus tax. Yeah, can we do sixty nine in the room though? No, not for the sixty nine. The including tax, the eighty one. Okay, so 81 we can do in the room. Uh, 69 we got to give to you. 69.99 plus tax. Okay, let me put my brother Dwayne on. He can make what? sense of this, I think. Here. Hi. Hi, how much How much money are we talking? Okay, the 69.99 plus tax and we do require the $50 deposit. Okay, so me, me and my brother, we got about $6 we're trying to spend with you. What? We got about six dollars. We're trying to give you. That's about it. That's about all we're gonna be able to afford. Sixty nine ninety nine plus tax, and we do yeah. require six dollars and ninety nine cents. Yeah, I understand. And a dollar fifty. Not for the six sixty nine ninety nine cents. I have I have three two dollar bills. Motherfucker. Get a bop, Hey! Hey, Kuta! Shit! Tera maka busra benches. Hello? Aram jari kute. Ben? Yes.
Sweet Dwayne speaking. How can I help you? Dwayne? Dwayne? Yes. Or is it Dwayne? Dwayne, how can I help you? Hey, um, we need a room. This, uh, Union Pacific? Union Pacific? Yeah, in the, in the train? We need a room, yeah. like a car, sleeping car? Yeah. No. I don't have any rooms. What? What? What are you talking about? You said Union Pacific. Usually I have uh, Union Pacific people calling, asking for a room. And they know me by name. Oh, I see. So you, you give preferential treatment to people there with the Union Pacific. But for me, you got nothing. No, I honestly have no rooms. And I was going to tell them the same thing. Oh. I have no rooms. I'm sold out. We can do the secret handshake to prove to you that no I'm room. worthy. I have no rooms. I'm honestly sold out. Tell them I oh. have no arms, Ted. Yeah, we're going to proceed to tell you a bunch of things that's going to make you feel bad and give us a room. Okay? Um, Try me. I was, a lo I was a lonely child. I didn't have many friends. I had but one good friend, but I turned on him many times, and it, it cr created a very psychologically difficult childhood, and um, now I'm an adult, and uh, I'm still socially awkward, and nobody likes me. So, is that enough? I have a small piece of violin that says, my heart bleeds for you. I tripped and fell down I didn't and skinned my knee. I didn't know you cared. Gentlemen, I, gentlemen, I honestly have no rooms. I am completely sold out. What if Surely I told you? have you. a closet, a towel closet. What if I, I honestly yeah. have no rooms. My next door neighbor might have some home away. He's Your a next homo. door neighbor. My hotel what next door is yeah, that's not nice. home away. Home away. Home away. home away from a home away. Home away. Home, home away is the name I'm of the way of homos? How do you spell no, that? The way of home? It's home it's away? Hotel. Uh -huh. Oscar. Mike. Uh -huh. Echo. Mike. Echo. Alpha. Homo. Alpha. Whiskey. Gamma. Alpha. Yankee. Beta. What Zeta. kind of whiskey is that? Alpha. Ginky. Mm. Me. Gentlemen, I'm going to hang that up now. cheap stuff? Wait. No, don't okay. do that. You just want that's a room. Just no, that's tonight. not better. Yeah, it's because it's we're... Hello? Dr. Jane, Mr. Charles, can I help you? Yeah, uh, I, I put my head on the pillow the wrong way. Uh, how do I get out of here? Uh, I don't know. Where you at? Well, the pillow is, it's, uh, it's stuck. It's affixed. Um, I'm not sure if this was a, a joke or something. Like someone super glued it, like gorilla glued <laughs> my hair. Yeah, okay. It's not, well, no, I'm stuck to the sheet and my head's stuck to the pillow. Here, here, here. I'm going to look at the manager. Oh, all right. Oh, Oh, boy. Hello? Hi, yeah, I I'm stuck between the pillow and the sheet. Uh, someone, I guess they were using Gorilla Glue or something on on the bed sheets here. <coughs> Maybe, I, I don't know, but I'm stuck. Okay, well, I guess we need to call the ambulance. And... Uh, no, no, I just need, I was wondering if you if you had, like, someone with a pry bar or something, you could get me off this headboard. <laughs> I what room are you in? Oh, I'm in the bedroom, uh... It's it's east of the stairs. East of the stairs. Yeah. What room are you in? What room number are you in? Oh, I think it's two one five, but it could be wrong. It's you know, there's whatever's in on here. It's it's stuck to my ear. It's it's been pulling for a while now. I could be wrong about my facts. Hey, we're we're uh, we're, we're, uh, 
Nine one one right now. Oh, two one five. I'm in the. Hey, Dennis. You. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. I oh, got no, no, out no, of the, the situation. We were, well, we've already oh, called 911. They will seriously be here in a minute. I hope. I mean, we know you're in 108, though. Oh, no, I'm not. We're sending them down to 108. Thank you. I never you. said that. I day, never sir. said that. That ain't me, man. Home away street. <laughs> this is Lacey. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? Hi. Hi. There you are. What can I help with? Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm a little man. And, um, yeah, I was wondering for some small accommodations. Are you looking to rent a room at Home Away Suites? Because I can help you with that. Yeah, um, I was just wondering if you had a room that was more like dollhouse sized with, like, little furniture and little chairs. No, we don't. See, I had an accident, and um, we have well, it was an accident room. in the lab. I oh well, you see, I was I was trying to make my down there parts bigger, and I accidentally made my whole body smaller. It was a lab accident, that and uh, it's making it really difficult. It's making it very difficult get a room because I mean I can't open the door maybe I could slide underneath it but you probably have the back suites on the door right to keep all the roaches out and oh, um, yeah so what can you do for me um, I only have regular rooms I'm sorry you have a, a reversing machine like that will undo oh. my lab accident? No, sorry. I don't. Did you stretch me like a piece of bubble gum and maybe I would stretch out to my normal size? No. No, there's nothing hmm. else I can do for you. I hope you have a good night. Well, my predicament prevents me from having a good night and looking to you, the kind woman on the phone. Yeah. Right. Sorry, there's not anything I can do. Um, what about room service? Um, what do you mean by rooms? So like, we have maids that'll come clean the rooms. If that's what you're asking, we have that. Yeah, I'm afraid of that because I might get picked up by the vacuum, and um, so I. I you may have to give them a heads up if I choose to stay there. Gotcha. Are there are there any bars or places where people meet up in the area? Um, oh, maybe, I wouldn't know about that. I don't go out really. I you go know to work of, and I go to the grocery store. Oh. Yeah, because I'm looking to meet a, a woman that's about you know, two inches tall, um, sort of like a honey, I shrunk the kids kind of dealy. Yeah, I don't know anybody like that. Hmm. Well, maybe you just haven't seen them. They're too, they're too little. That's possible. I can't say that I've, that I know anyone. Hmm. Oh, well, this Sorry. has been helpful. You're probably wondering how I can operate a phone when I'm only two inches tall. Yeah, but I'm a man of science, that. so I figured it out. What? You, you didn't have oh. one in your pocket? No, not when the accident happened. So now I just stand on top of the cell phone, and I jump to the different numbers that I want to dial. Uh, that's how that works. It's like a game of, it's like a game of hopscotch. Um, that must be tiring. Whew. So let's not jump to any conclusions here about whether, uh, you know, the room will work out for me. 
Um, right. Yeah. How about, you know those, back in the old days when they had, the, the banks had those tubes that you put the money in and stuff and it go, it would like fly yeah. through the, the tube and it would go, yeah. I could travel in one of those to the room if you sort of retrofitted one from the front desk all the way to the room. I don't think we would have any sort of system that way. And if we put one in, it'd probably be expensive. Mm, I think you're being hysterical here. I don't think it's that big of a deal. No? Mm. I mean, I'll, I can help you out. Uh, go to Home Depot. Get about uh, 400 feet of PVC, uh, two inches diameter, and some glue, pipe glue, and um, a saw. And uh, just get the cut and then join in the pieces, you know, until it reaches the room. And you're going to need an air compressor on both sides. Yeah. You want me to price that out for you? No, I'm good. You'd have to run it by my bosses anyway. Oh, are, are they against little people? No, it's just their money. So if they were going to be spending any money, it'd be them. I mean, I've I seen the place. It's not that nice. I don't think anyone would notice if I made, like, big holes in the wall. I mean... Someone might. Um, well, just just a personal question. Have you ever okay. been with a man of diminutive stature? Can't say that I have. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Well, I'm going to go, and hopefully I won't drown in some morning dew. All right. I hope not. Uh, all right. You have all a right. good night. You as well. Bye-bye. Bye. Hello? Hi. We want to hear your hold music. Can you, do you mind putting us on hold for a second? Um. Hey, hey, before you do that, can you put your mother on hold? Okay, no, just oh, put us on hold. Please don't hang up. Shit! <laughs> we just want to hear your hold music. Please just put us on hold. Miss. Greetings. Quit grabbing the phone like that. It sounds weird. Miss, can you please put us on hold? All right, we'll put ourselves on hold. Here we go. I know where Mineral Wells is. Porno shop. Oh. Hello? Hello. Hi, where's the great big porno shop up there? I'll admit. It. Hello. Hello, please. Hello. Hi. How are you? Hi, my brother Dwight is here. Mhm. Hi. Hello. 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 Hi. Do you think we're saying that I'm help you? Hi. Hello. How are Hello. you? I'm good. How are I'm you? I'm I'm good. Is this a place? Is what what is this place I called? Um, Ace Motel. Okay, good, good. I wanted to make sure because I've been dialing a few different numbers, and uh-huh. so like I'm in my room. I'm in my room right now, and I uh-huh. can't I can't get the I can't get the adult channels to turn on my TV. Um, what room number? Uh, ten. Room number ten. Okay. Yeah, I can't, but I can't get the adult the adult movies. I can't get them to turn on. Oh, you're uh, room number ten from Ace Motel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mhm. Okay. 
the music. I'm, I'm trying to watch. I'm trying to watch. Na- I'm trying to watch Naked Ladies on the TV. Oh, I don't know. I don't. I don't know about that. Do I have to rub the remote control in a special way to get them to turn on? I don't know. I'm sorry. Because I see this this very erotic one that's on. Like I'm trying to watch it. It's apparently African American ladies, and they have they have penises, and they like to be choked. And I, I want to watch it, and it's not letting me watch it. You want to come watch with me? Yeah. Some, someone worked that into something. Call Hello. And rub it on the belly. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. Hello. Hello. Yes. Right. What are you Hello. doing? Uh, there's Nothing. a problem. Yeah, you are. You okay, go ahead. I'm in my room. I'm in my room. <laughs> what are okay. you doing? There's a problem with the remote control. Which room you are in? Did somebody just curse or make the curse language behind you? The shit! <laughs> holy, holy fuck. <laughs> Sir. Yes. Uh, oh, I rubbed the remote control for the TV, and a genie came out. He granted me three wishes. And I had to. You have Epstein? What? Holy, holy fuck! Listen, listen, I rubbed the remote control and the genie appeared. Do you get that part? Yes. Okay. I made my first wish. What should be my first wish? Drink. No, 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 you're gonna lose your you're gonna lose your wish if you can't communicate it clearly. Holy moly! Okay, I'll make I'll make a wish for you. Is that okay? Yes. All right. I wish for you to be able to hear people when they talk and understand the words that are coming out of their mouth. That's the first way. That's so very good. I like it. Yes. Are you a, are you a machine? No. Okay. You know, because the age of AI, I need to make sure I'm not giving my wishes away to a machine. Say, I am not a machine. Say it. I am not a machine. Okay, I'm, I'm convinced. I bet, I, bet he, I bet he says that to his wife when she makes him fuck all the time. He's like, I'm not a machine. Come on. Are you ready for your second I need wish? To... Yes. It's... You're ready? Yeah. Okay, I wish that you can please your wife in the bedroom at least once per year. Thank you. Oh. I love you, okay? No, I don't swing that way, though. You got to... You gotta take it home, homeboy. I ain't going fast enough to ever hurt anybody, and I don't even want to see anybody. Are are there are there 
Well, who are those people talking? Shit. Who are those people in the background? They're annoying me. They're, they're interrupting our conversation. They're God people. They're God people? God people. Like, uh, Jehovah Witness? No. No. They are from First Nation. The fuck is that? Anyway. I don't want. I I love you. Okay. No, no. I told you that's not possible. Hey. Okay, the, the last wish. What do you wish for? I want to meet my friends. You want to what? Meet I want, your... I want to meet my friends. Meet your sin. What does friend. that mean? Friend. Oh, who is your friend? Yes. Yeah, well, I got a you know it. Where, where do you want to meet your friend? I'm the daughter of God, your father. At my place. Okay, do you want there to be candles and rose petals on the bed when your friend arrives? No. 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 I want beers and drink. Oh, so it's not that kind of friend, huh? No. Oh, so you got friend zoned, is what you're telling me. Yes. What kind of beer? Marijuana. What, what kind of beer? The genie is very specific. Hizzle. Hizzle? 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 Yeah. Yeah. What's Jizzo? All right. Um, I need to ask the genie if he can translate because this is crazy. Thank you. Hey, genie. Genie, what's a Jizzo? I'm a box of shooting heat. Oh, the genie doesn't know. You're gonna have to pick a different beer. Shit. How about some nice Bud Light? Would you like that? This is the Can you repeat that again? What, what Bud, what beer she wants? Tell me. You heard that, right? The genie is asking. I am the genie. Stop making up names and pick an American beer. Go. You don't want to piss the genie off. I love you. I am a little PG, okay? I don't know who you are, but I love you. I will suck your dick. This is, this is the genie. I don't know. How about Coors? Coors Light. Thank you. Yeah, but mining truck. Mining truck? Yeah. My, uh, what? The genie is confused. Are you? I, I may. We got penis. I'm going to ask the God, penis? What? What did you say? Hello, Edge of Hotel? Hello? Hello? Oh, hi. Hello? Hello? Hello. Oh. Ma'am? Hello? Hello? Do you guys have yeah. racers at the front desk? Pardon me? Do you have razors, like, for shaving? Razors? For shaving? Yeah. Yes, yeah, for um, shaving. No, we don't have razors. Okay. Shit. Um. Yeah, because 
Oh my gosh, it's kind of a long story, but um, my my daughter's staying here in the room with my husband and I, and uh, she's um, Hispanic, and she grows like a mustache, like a man, you know, like facial hair, you know? Okay. And um, she's going to prom, and she's very upset because she forgot to shave her mustache, and it's it's super long. Um have you seen the movie Napoleon Dynamite? Hello, Minna Motel. Hi, yeah, uh, I'm an adult, and I was wondering if you have adult beds there. Uh, you have a dog? No, adult. I have oh. one. I have oh, one oh. adult here. Yeah. Oh, uh, just but we ha- we don't have a room with uh. We don't have a room with one bed. Just have a room with two beds. Oh yeah, that's fine. He's just adult, you know. He's just, you know, okay. he's kind of, he's kind of, you know. Okay, no problem. Stupid, uh, when, honestly. Okay. Uh, when will you be here? Oh, uh, you know, it would probably be about an hour from now. Uh, we're just we're getting okay. something to eat. You know, he's okay, no problem. he's an adult. Okay. Okay. No problem. Okay. Okay, I'll uh, see, you, uh, see you uh, later. Well, no, here, let me put him on the phone so he can explain the situation. Hi. I'm on the phone. Okay. Hello? Hello? Okay, yeah. So, I'm ready for the training. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so uh, when when do we start? Uh. Uh, uh, this is Windsor Motel, so uh, do you need a room? Yeah, I'm ready. Um, there's the the big kumite there this weekend at the hotel. Um, yeah, I'm I'm kind of rusty. I haven't been in the ring for a while. Um, I need some, you know, some sparring tips. Uh, I don't understand you, so... Oh, okay, uh, my name is Frank Dukes. Yeah. So you stayed you in have me in the system? before? Have I stayed there before? No, I'm just coming for the fight. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm going for the competition. Uh, in short, uh, do you need a room for tonight? Well, yeah, for the competition, because there's this guy, and um, my brother fought him when I was very young. And, you know, you know, my brother, he unalived my brother, and now I want to get, you know, revenge on him. But I need somewhere to train uh, in the meantime. Uh, uh, sorry, I kind of follow you. So yeah, I know this is this is really hard to you know to explain. But um, my master said that um, you know at the moment that I could snatch the pebble from his hand, then I would be ready to fight. And I haven't yet snatched the pebble. Yeah. CD Central Motel, how can I help you? Sorry? Hello? Yeah. Hello? um, My boyfriend and I need a room. Hello? Uh huh. Hello? Yeah, you want to book a room? Boyfriend? Yes. Oh, price? We're booking a room. It's the first time that. What? Yeah. Yes, I can hear you. Yes, we're booking a room because we met on Grinder and we're making love for the first time. Grinder? Yeah, Grinder. It's this cool website. It's like Facebook, but it's all like sodomy and blowjobs and stuff. What? 
Yes, we met on Grinder. Anyway, we, I need a room. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, can I have your name, please? Yes, my name is Max. Yes, uh, uh, family name? Hard on. You serious? <laughs> yes, it's a it's a it's been passed down in my family for generations. Okay. <laughs> Check in time is today. Could you please address me? Could you please address me by my name? Uh, okay. You got a credit card number? Yes, but can can you address me by my name, please? As a sign okay. of respect. Okay. Uh, you're not kidding, right? I'm not. Hello. I'm very serious. Okay. Uh, have to refuse you. Excuse me? Why? Hello, can I help you? Hello? Go ahead, Dad. Hello, can I help you? Go ahead. Hi, how you doing there, honey baby? I need to get a room. How many people? Um, how many rooms you got for people? How many people? Well, how many openings do you have? Because we got a lot of people. I just need to know where to put them, you know. How many rooms do you need? I don't know how many people to a room. <laughs> how many people and uh, how many rooms do you need? Well, I don't know how many how rooms. How many spaces? But I need, yeah, how many spaces do you got? You'll check in today? No, tomorrow. Tomorrow will be the day. Tomorrow? Tomorrow is, uh, please tell me your, your, how many rooms, how many people stay in? I you, got six people. In? Six people with me. Six but people? We, yeah, we've been splitting up across, you know, multiple hotels and stuff. That's what we've been doing. Six people, how many rooms? So? Yeah. Well, how many people Three to spaces. a room? Hello? How many people to a room? I don't, is that someone on your end? Do you need one bed or two bed? Well, it's uh, six people. We can do, like, if you have two beds, then we can have four people to a room, right? Oh, so... Two beds, two beds, two beds, total six people? Yeah, two beds with six people. That sounds good. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I have rooms for you. Okay, and is it okay if we bring Grandma? Hello? Yeah, is it okay if we bring Grandma? Grandma? What do you mean? Here, let me put her on. Here, Grandma, here, take take the phone. Take it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yes. yes. Do you Hello. need a room tomorrow? Yes, I need a room tomorrow. And my paper type was changed. This is Bandy. Won't, it won't take my typer off and clean it. I haven't had my backside cleaning in over a year. Now, I, Hello. How are you? Yes. Hello. Yeah, six people. You need uh, three rooms. Yes, I said. I said. I said I'm a part of poo. Now, what say you? What are we having for dinner, dear? Is it Hello? time to go? Hello. Hello. It's not Hello. Please send there. me email, please. Okay. Yes. Please send me email. How do we do that? Okay, thank you. Please send me email, please. Okay? Oh, thank you, Pegasus. Thank you, Thank you, bye bye. Thank you, Pegasus. Thank you, bye bye. Hey, go. Hello. Hello. Hello.
Hello? 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 How many spaces what? is that, sir? Uh huh. How many? You need how many? Yeah, rooms? how many spaces is? Uh, yeah, in the in the party hall, uh, how many spaces do you have? Uh, you need one bed, two bed. Uh, three spaces, please. Three beds. The family room is uh, one four plus tax. Uh, how much are the spaces? Uh, uh, tax tax is uh, uh, one one forty plus tax. In the party hall. Yeah. Through that. Um, okay. Get, can we touch it, please, before we buy? Yeah. How much? M what? What? How much? Yeah. How much space is the Mugu guy pan? Uh, to get total is uh, include the tax. Okay, just a moment. It's one sixty one. Uh, okay. Can we make a deal with a bargain yeah. for that? Can we just pay yeah. three one? Okay, three one. Okay, good deal. So, I yeah. think they're going to have an extra party hole in the spaces. How many spaces do you think we're going to need, sir? I'm making pee. Oh, oh. oh. You're getting all over my foot. Yeah, put your shoes hey. in there. Woo. My socks are soaked. What yeah. the heck? Hello? Oh, 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 no, are we still on the phone? Oh, God. Oh, yeah, you, you want to book the room? The you want to book uh, the party room? Yeah, it stinks. Man. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes uh, tonight? Yeah, tonight. 30, 31. Oh, yeah, God. room 31? Yeah, that sounds good. Ro room 31? Yeah, you're yeah. flushing uh -huh. the toilet in the room. War room 30, yeah? Or 31. Yeah, we're flushing room 31. The services are room. We're flushing. 30, it's downstairs, it's a room, yeah? We're flushing the toilet. Yeah, move good guy pan, please. Okay. Hello? And, uh, could, yeah, can we get room service? Is room service available, Egg Foo Young? To Young? Yes, sir. Please deliver. Deliver? Yes. Liver with onions. One order. One order, yeah. Yeah, how many spaces? Uh, what I I don't understand you. So you want to book the room? Yeah, you want yeah. to do the YouTube book video. Room? This is a real hot YouTube video on Grinder. Gordo's watching it right now. Yeah. Okay, wait a moment. I look Gordo. for another card to help you. This is my favorite part. Oh, fuck yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Coming out. It's look at the party it. Home. Yeah, you can come here now. It's getting yeah, bigger. Yeah, he's got his wang in the wong. Wong number. Spaces. Look at when he rubs it. Oh, my goodness. All red and angry. Swollen up. What it just gets bigger. Sir? It's like uh Yeah. If you want to book the room so you warrior. can give me your name and the phone number and the credit card number for hold this room. It's okay? Yes, yeah, spaces with the purple helmet. For how much is one sixty one? Include tax. Can I ask uh, you a question, sir? Can I ask you a question? Question? Sure. Question? Yes. So, would you rather would you rather have a twelve inch penis 
or two pound balls? Two pound ball. I don't know. Yes, or a twelve inch penis. I don't understand. How big is your I penis think it's now? On that we should video. start there. Yeah. Oh, which moment? Do you have a smartphone? Can you measure with the app? Actually, actually, tip to me. We can hear that this the guy side is. Uh, he wants. He wants to book the family room. I give him uh, one forty. Yeah, the party room, tip to root. Hello? Tip to root. Hello? Yes, he was telling us, yes, he was telling us some things that were really confusing to me. Okay, what's up? (laughs) Yeah, he was saying that, like, he would give us the room for 140, but he would give us a bigger discount if my dad would show him, like, his penis. What? Gotcha. Yeah, it was really, really weird. I, I don't know what to say. Like, cause he said that, oh, I'll give you a better rate, and I said, oh, that's thank you, you know, I appreciate it. And he's like, your dad, you know, like, to come down to his room or something or where he works, and for him to show him his penis. I don't know. <laughs> Hold on. I'm I'm only 11 years old. How much is the party spaces? I I'm trying to find out what's going on. Okay, you ask him, son. Alpine. Hi. Alpine. Well, Hi, can I make a room booking there? Yeah, sure. Okay. When uh, you want. Are you open tomorrow? Yes. Okay, uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow, you want a room or you want to come to book tomorrow? Oh, I want a room, yeah. I thought I could book today, and I can be there tomorrow. Okay. Or do I book tomorrow and then come today? Do you have today? a credit card? Uh, no, I, ha- I do card? cash. I, I use uh, the paper, the Queen's good paper. Okay. Sometimes yeah. you're supposed to wipe your uh, your backside with it uh, here, so you can give her a little, you know, a little makeup. What do you think? Yeah, you give the the queen, you know, some makeup when you use the paper money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 What's your name? Oh, my name's Fred. Fred. Right. Yeah, Here, thank you. Yeah. Okay. What yeah, do I do right. now? What do I do now? What do I do? Well, your room is booked already. Oh, okay, so I'll come there. I'll bring you yeah. the money that I that I may have yeah. used as toilet paper, and and uh, we'll square everything away. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for calling Heritage. I may help you. Hello. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. I may help you. I am. Um... I was wondering if you guys got vending machines there. Uh, unfortunately, sir, our vending machine is broken. It's out of service. Hey, I have a question. Uh, do you have water fountain, though? Water Sorry, fountain? sir? Do you have water fountain? Water? What? You're breaking over the line, sir. I'm sorry yeah. about that. I need a water fountain. You got a water fountain? Water... Sir. Water yeah. fountain. Do you have it? Sir, come again. Uh, you are really break, breaking over the line. Uh, 
Water what? Water fountain. Water fountain. Yeah. Nope, nope. We don't have it yet. How about your mother's vagina? Sorry, sir? Can you hear that? Your mother's vagina. Hello? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, go ahead. You were asking something? Uh, Hello? Hello? Yeah. Can you hear, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, that's uh, even clearer now. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> Oh, wow. What All were right. you asking hey, a no. moment ago? Mm, I, I just kind of wanted to ask about something. If you knew anything about coins, uh, Canadian, because I got one. Uh, Meow. I got, I got a toonie here. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay, what he's trying to get at is that he's really interested in your mom, and he was wondering if she would take coin. Yeah. Ex there you go. Well, Just take it from there. Hello? 1870, $2. It's got the queen on it. It's from Newfoundland, all right? So, I mean, look, I, I grew up Prince Edward Island. Do you know where that is? PEI, all that? And I got this gold ass toonie. It's got three dots, not the two dots. If you've checked online, all right, coin, base, all that. Um, and I'm just wondering, do you know anyone around your area that collects two dollar coins from Newfoundland in the 1800s? Uh, sorry to say, sir, but uh, I, I really don't have a clue. You don't have a clue. All right, um, but. It's, you know, it's still legitimate, right? Have you never had one? Like, Canadians use, like, coins to spend dollars. You know, like the loonies and the toonies and all that. So, you must have come across, like, a $2 coin before. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, no, I'm just, just get me to the point, sir. Uh, I'm not really getting to yeah, right. Uh, you the take rupees? Point, the point being is, can I pay you to come over here and just um, put your tongue in my mouth? Which room are you, sir? I'm in room 310. Room, room what again, sir? I'm in room 310. That would be, uh, un de trois, trois, un, trois, un. Yeah, yes. Si, uh, I mean, oui. Sir, uh, uh I think you're calling the uh, wrong number. Cute. Maybe it is the wrong number, but you're the right guy. Yeah, you know, so, uh, just just we bet, just we bet. All right. Um, yeah, yeah. Tomorrow, Let me get this tomorrow. straight, sir. Uh, yeah. Yes. What? Yeah, you are calling uh, Heritage in right now, and you are. Fromage. You were saying that you in you are in. Room 310, is that right? Oui. Mi amor. It's all right. You can take your time. You can take your time. It's all right. Good evening. Thank you for calling the glow. This is Vianne. How can I help you? Good evening. Thank you for calling the glow. This is Hello. 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 Can I help you? Can I help you? Hello. 
Hello? Country and motel. Country and motel. Oh, country. country and motel. Hello? Hello, I can hear you. Hello? Hello, I can't hear you, sir. I can hear you, can sir. You can hear me? You can hear me? I can't hear you. Hello? You can't hear me? Can you hear Hello? me? Can you hear us, sir? We need, we, need we need to book a room. We need to book a room. Hi, this is Econo Lodge. Hi, this is Econo Lodge. Hi. Hi, this is Econo Hi, I'd like to... Hi, I'd like, I'd like to, to... Book a room? Book a room? You want to book a room? Yeah, is there yeah, something wrong room. with your room? Yeah, there's something wrong with your room. Book a room. Hello? Yeah. I'd like to book yeah. a room, please. Where? I, Tomorrow for tom- I don't even know what that is in the background. I'm not going to lie. Background noise. Oh, no, I don't know. Okay, so you hear it, too. It's not just me. Hold on, hang up, and then call back. Okay, yeah, I'll try to give you a call back. Don't hang up. All right. The fuck is that? Somebody's clicking. Stop at. Rancho, stop at. Mute. Hello? I'm sorry. Hello? 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 Yeah, I can hear you. Hi, yeah, Sexy. I can hear you. Pretty good. What can I help you? Very good. What can I help you with? Very good. What can, you can I have sex with your mother? What? 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 You heard me. Happens every shoe. Hello? May I help you? Hello? 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 Hello. I want to know where my bancho is. Huh? Huh? Do you have you seen my bancho? Royal Hotel Chilliwack, Ben speaking. Hi. Hi. Uh, I had some questions about the room. Sure. Okay, because we were there, and there was like a sticky oil substance on the ground, and it tracked all uh, over the place. It tracked into our car. Um, yeah. Uh, like, where oil? was the sticky? Where was the sticky oil? It was. It was out uh, near the parking lot. The the front parking lot or the back parking lot? Oh, the back parking lot. It was a, a whole lot. It was like someone maybe changed their oil and just poured it out everywhere. Uh, okay. Uh, was that a normal occurrence? Do people just come there and dump their oil out back there? No, it's not a normal occurrence. Okay. Uh Are you are you currently a guest of the hotel? Oh no, God no, no! I would never stay there. No, I was I was there picking up my ex-wife. Well, I don't I don't understand the issue then because we don't have control over what happens in the parking lot. Well, it's sticky. And. Well, it got everywhere. I'm sorry, but we don't clean the parking lots. So yeah, but her her feet got not, you know they were up in the air in the car, and the oil got everywhere. I I'm not understanding what you want me to do about that. Well, can you help clean it? The, I'm gonna I'm gonna come by with my car, and you can come clean it. No, I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, you're going to. You're gonna help me out here. I'm gonna buy it. No, I'm not. I'm gonna you buy can go it. get your car detailed. 
Well, no, I'm it's not our by. responsibility. Well, you you made this mess. We did not. Well, you did, but you're not having your parking no. lot cleaned. Yeah. It's not our responsibility. It's well, a it shared your, parking lot with multiple okay. business, businesses. You have the liability. It is the city's. You know. No, it is the city's responsibility to maintain that parking lot. Yeah, but when when we were when we were in the car, you know, and her legs were up, and it was pressing against my my leather interior, and now it's it's sticky. Yeah, well, there's nothing I can or will do about this. It's not my problem. But I saw her private area, and it scared me. I don't. I don't care. This is probably just a prank, and I'm done with this call. Have a nice day. I'm not sure. I don't know. Hello? Uh, I don't know what to do. What's a prank? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Really? Thanks I for calling Holiday and Chilliwack. This is no. Karen. How may I help you today? No, I have to go somewhere in the morning, and I was wondering if I could stay there tonight. You're looking to book a reservation for tonight? Well, I was hoping you had, like, a room or maybe a pod or a hole I can just stick myself into for the night. I'm sorry, we don't, but thanks for calling. Oh, what? Good evening, Vetter River Inn, front desk. Hi, I'd like to book a room. Okay. Are you looking for something specific? I'm looking for um, something that... Sorry, I'll let my husband talk. Yeah, I'm looking for something that would just be um, accommodating to a party of three or more. Okay. And what date are you looking for? I'm looking for May the 12th, so uh, as soon as you can, okay. really. All righty. So I have a couple of rooms with two double beds available. Um, and then on the... On the twelfth, I'm <clears throat> sorry. On the twelfth, I also have my executive suite. So uh, the executive suite will have two queen beds, one single, and a pull-out couch with a full-size kitchen. Hello, are you still there? Wow. So that's two queens. For uh, for which one? For the full size bed. Sorry, uh, are you talking about the executive suite or the room with the two doubles? Oh yeah, the executive suite. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, so that's going to have the two queen beds. Two queen beds. Is there any additional surcharge for the executive suite? There's not additional pets surcharge at this moment. Uh, we're not pet friendly. There's we're not no pet additional. We're no. There's no additional surcharges, um, but the room is going at two hundred and sixty-five dollars plus the taxes for the night. Plus the taxes for the night. Are there any deposits? Deposits required. Uh, sorry, I uh, do you mean deposits? Uh, do you mean deposits? Is your hotel highly regarded? Well, we we've got really good reviews online. <laughs> we're really uh, we're popular. We have really good reviews in person because what I'm looking for is uh, word of mouth. Okay. okay. So, like, are are you looking for a simple are hotel, looking or are you looking for something for like the Ritz? Hotel, are you looking for something like the Ritz? I'm just looking for some head game. I'm looking for something like the Bellagio. Okay, then you're going to want either the Royal Hotel downtown or the Holiday Inn just off the highway. The highway.
But I want Bellagio luxury at Motel 6 I prices. I can't hear anything. You're not going to get it for Motel 6 prices. I mean, even we're mo- more expensive than Motel 6. And we're clean and simple. Uh, we're not, you know, nothing gold, nothing glitz, nothing glamour. Yeah, but can you do, you know, um, full service? How so? Well, all the services that you'd normally get at a, you know, establishment like the Bellagio. Um, we we do most of them. Uh, we don't have a valet service. We don't have um, we don't have a valet parking. Um, and unfortunately, we do not have a turndown service. But everything else, we uh, we do match. How about do you have machines a... in the room? Uh, sorry. I'm um, just looking to see if I could do some gambling inside of the room while I'm there tonight. So no, uh, we don't have a casino on site. Uh, the closest one is about uh, it's about five kilometers from us. I think Chilliwack really only has the one casino. What in the hell and it does, does not have an attack. Uh, Can kilometers you speak English? measured. <laughs> Yeah, well, how, measure by what? Like, what does that mean? Like, measure like kilometers, miles? Is that that's not our measurement system? How many miles is what I'm trying to say? Uh, hold on a sec. Mental math here. Uh, it is. Yeah, that's all right. Five, five miles to one kilometer, so it's going to be approximately ten, twelve, thirteen, about fifteen or so miles. Give or take a few. Does the room come with a complimentary massage? No. How about else? you? <clears throat> Do you come with a complimentary massage? Cute. I'll hook you up. I'll hook you up. Yeah, you are. I see. I see you right now. I went through the the uh, lobby earlier, and I saw you there, and that's why I'm calling you tonight because you look you look good. So, just want to know if you know maybe you know get something on the extra <laughs> if you're interested. Uh, what was what was that old man doing in the basement with an overgrown Furby in the movie Gremlins? Don't know. Never actually seen the movie. Never actually seen the movie. Are you? You've uh, never seen Gremlins, Gremlins? okay? Oh no, actually, I've, I've not seen. I've not seen Gremlins. There was a man outside you? the hotel earlier, and he was holding up a sign. And help me if you can, but the sign on it it had three letters. It was S E X, and he kept pointing at the sign and said, "This feels really good." Do you know what that means? And I was like, "I don't know." Do you know what that means? Because I don't. All right. Well, we'll have to look into that. Is there anything else I can help you guys with tonight? Why? Yeah, the um, That's a really good question. <clears throat> Are you pleading the fifth? Oh no! Our car is uh, the Is this coming? Hey, asshole, how are you? Uh, yes. Go ahead. Hello? There's this guy how here in my room, and he keeps playing with balls. Well, look at the balls. Uh, sorry. Balls, 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 balls. Yeah. Hello? Can you hear him? He's playing with my balls as we speak. Oh, yeah. Who? 
Balls, 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 balls. This guy right here, you just keep saying balls. Balls. I kind of like these Canadian calls. Though. I do too. They seem to entertain them more and be lighter. More How do you feel about the San Jose Sharks? Hello? 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 Hey, dear. Thank you for Hi calling there. the Super 8 Hotel. Thank you for calling the Super 8 Hotel. How can I help you? Yes, Hi, I'd like uh, to want to know how you feel about the Super 8. Hello. Is that a good place to work? Daddy Fat Sacks, are you going to join this call? Straight guy? I'm going to be the cat. I'm going to meow. Hello? Hotel Hello? Hi there. Hi there. Hello? Hi. Hello? Hello? Yes, Hi, can uh, I reserve a room, I'd like please? I'd book a room, please. Hello, I cannot hear you. Hello, I Hello, cannot hear I you. Hello, I cannot hear you. Yes, I'd like to book a room, please. Yes, I'd like to book a room, please. Actually, I'm gonna. Hello, I see. I, I hear three hear you. echoes. You have to call me back. I hear three echoes. You have to call me back. Hello. Thank you. Uh, oh, hello? Yeah, Thank three you. echoes. You have to Can call I me book back. A room, please? <laughs> I hear three. Good evening, Hotel Fantasta. Speaking, how can I help you? Good evening, Hotel Fantasta. Can I help you? Hey, my husband and I would like to book a room, please. Hello? Hey, hello? Hello? Um, actually... Yes? Um, oh, actually, my husband... Yes, my husband and I would like to book a room, please. Actually, I hear my own echo. Actually, I hear my own echo. Hello? Yes, can you hear me? We'd like to book a room, please. Can you hear me? me? We'd like to book a room, please. Me and my husband. Actually, I can hear my own echo. Hello? 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 I would like to book a room, please. Hello? Hello, are you there? Yes, in. Hello? Hi, hi. Hi, I'm I'm wondering if you have any rooms available for the night. I'm sorry? You have room available for my body to lie? And uh yeah, we do sleep? have double beds. Okay. Do you have um do you have room can for you hold on a, can you hold on please? Oh. Uh, oh What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You we have to hold on. What are you doing? Oh. What are you doing that we had to hold on? Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh. You heard what I mean. The moose is touching me. Hello? Holiday Motel. Hi, yeah, the moose is touching me. Uh, it's by my car and it was touching me. The moose. Hello? Hello? Yeah, there's a moose out here. It's touching me. <laughs> His name is Rocky. I'm I'm waiting for a punchline, and, and uh, I'm not getting it. All right, so this moose... All right, the punchline is your ass. How about that? The punchline's your ass. <laughs> it's not a very good punchline. Okay, yeah, you like next that? one. You would like that, don't you? Piece of All right, shit. the next line is in my pants, and you're going to have to get on your knees and find out how to get it. Oh. 
world mark michael speaking hi michael listen there's a moose out here and his name is bullwinkle and he's touching me <laughs> okay yeah that's all <laughs> That's it. I like it. All right. That's it? Have a good night. That's it. Oh, okay. You broke I was hoping me. You laughed. Some more. You laughed instantly. You broke me. There you go. Okay, well, tell him hi night. for me. Okay, yeah, you too. Yeah, he's here. Michael. What? Michael, this is the moose. Yes, I'm the one who touched his balls. <laughs> now, listen, okay. Michael... Have you ever heard of a recipe for molasses balls with coconut? Not lately. Wait, a couple days ago. Not lately. (laughs) A couple days ago. That's pretty lately, Michael. Okay. No, really? Yeah, so that's what I touched them with. Okay, all right. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. I love you. Bye. I especially enjoyed uh, sticking my arms in and trimming Blood. leaves over the week. Yeah, hi, I'm outside trimming the leaves on the plants, and they're getting I'm getting an allergic reaction from the leaves rubbing against my arms. From the what? The leaves. Like, I'm trimming the plants out here. They said it was okay if I just, you know, took my shears and started taking care of business. Uh, I was talking to a guy I'm earlier. Sorry, uh, he said, oh, yeah, just come back later and start cutting. Cutting it all down. Cut it all down. Take it all down. You know, you're free to take it all down, man. That's what he said. Um, I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, I was there earlier, and I asked, you know, is it okay if I, like, if I do some, you know, uh, amateur, you know, uh, landscaping? Cause I I dabble in it honestly and uh, and the guy there he said oh yeah yeah just come back later you know when no one's you know when it's sleepy time because he's always watching that sleepy time guy. Um what what you what room you have? Oh no no I'm not I'm not staying here no I'm I'm from town. So I just I just came by. Okay. And I was going to take care of the landscaping for you for free. I'm just going to bring my oh. tools. And I got a whole truck full of tools, man. I got a lawnmower. I got I got so, a trimmer. We're just going to we're just going to go and take care of this at night now. That way, you know, we don't interrupt everybody during the daytime. Yeah, that's good. Um I don't, I don't know, know. Yeah. um if it was me, I I don't think so. But I don't think so either. I don't remember. Uh, uh, I don't. I don't think you sound. The guy didn't sound like you at all. He said, "Oh yeah, yeah, I own the place." He said, and then he asked me, you know, did if you I call? get other services. He asked me. He said, "Hey, you know, if you come at night, you know, you pull down my pants, I'll show you my pecker." That's what he said to me, and I said, "Oh no, I'm not into that. I don't do that sort of thing, sir." I don't want to do that. What are you talking about? That's what he said. He said, oh, you know, you come back here later on, I'll show you my P.E.K.K.A. I said, no, um, I don't I don't swing I that way. I think you got the sir. wrong it's number. Not. Oh, no, it's the, it's the, it's this place right here. <coughs> okay, I'm going to hung up. You're going to hung up? Thank you for calling Best Western and Sweets. This is Eric. What's going on, Eric? This is Finkel. Hello. I, I got yeah. I got a question. I was talking to you guys about this expired milk I had up here. Uh, and, about uh, what? This expired milk I have up here. I was talking to you guys earlier about it, and the guy said to get a new milk. I I just had to uh, drink the expired milk, and it had like chunks and stuff into it. Why are you guys making me drink this? <laughs> what? Well, it's a whole gallon of milk. I really don't want to continue to drink this. It's all chunky. And you're you're a guest here? 
I, I don't want any more, Eric. I'm, I'm just going to level with you. I don't want to drink any more of this milk. Okay. Well, I, I'm a guest here. What do I do? Uh, what room are you in? Why, why are you guys forcing me to do this? I don't, I don't want to do this. I don't want to drink this milk. <laughs> well, what, what, which, what, what room number are you I, in? I, I, I'm getting physically, I'm physically recoiling from the taste. I'm, I, I think I'm gonna puke pretty quick here. Eric. Okay. What, uh, what, what room number are you? I, f- I feel like this is your guys' responsibility. Like you guys need to get this, uh, some papers served or. We're going to get the district attorney. I, I don't... Um, so, yeah, what, what's your uh, room number? How do I figure that out? Do you have the translocator? Oh. No, it would just be uh, the room that you're uh, in whenever you check in. Well, right now I'm, at, I'm by the toilet because I'm drinking all this expired milk. It's all chunky. It's like okay. a solid, uh, solid milk almost. This, yeah, this is yeah, like months expired milk. I really yeah, don't want to yeah, yeah. do this. No, yeah, yeah. Well, um, I don't think anyone's forcing you to do it. Well, he told me to. The, the, he's like, oh, I don't really give a shit. Just fucking drink the milk. Oh, you're an asshole. Fuck yeah. you. Ah, ah, da, 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 no, da, yeah, da, yeah, like, I feel that. See, see what, whatever, whatever that guy said. Uh, just, I would, I, just don't do that. Um, because uh, he. he I'm, t- well, he, I'm telling you not to drink the lobby. milk. He said he was the owner. He said he was the owner. Oh no! Yeah, there there is no owner of the hotel because uh, it's like a corporation. Uh, I mean, so they so uh, I don't know how franchises work? Are you stupid or you big stupid up there? No, no, no. So like so like the owner of the hotel. So, uh, he's, so uh, yeah, there's he, a thing he won't called be a here. franchisee. So even if it's a corporation, the franchisee open they own that specific location. You fucking no, idiot. No, yeah, but I'm. So, yeah, yeah, I know, but uh, I'm saying like the the owner of of this hotel, he doesn't he doesn't live in Arizona, so uh, so I don't think you uh, you spoke to him. You might have okay. just spoke to some uh, uh, you might have just spoke to some random guy in the lobby, and uh, he told you to drink expired milk, and you just kind of fell for it. And that's my fault you know? that you're le- letting some some random ass dude into the fucking hotel. Well, I mean, he might have been a guest here too. Or you're, or you're, um, letting, dr- you're letting drug but, addicts stay here. That's my fault somehow, or. Like, what are you implying? I mean, if I'm someone books a hotel room and they... Stupid. No, like, if someone books a hotel room and they pay, like, it's we, we kind of got to check them in. Um, we don't really ask if they have drug, uh, drug addictions and stuff, so... Are you on drugs right now? Or... Uh, I am not on drugs, sorry. Oh, I, I mean, I just had to double check. I couldn't really tell. No, yeah, yeah I'm not think, on drugs. You think you're... Um, but, you think but I would not. Shit. You think you're the best thing since butter toast, you know? You got yeah, smart ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but no, I would uh, I would not drink that spoiled milk. Um, I would not listen to can, whatever that person told you. Can you talk to Axva? What? He's my life mate. Hello? Can you talk to Axva? Hello? Hello? Hi, hi, how can I help you? Uh... Yeah, I'm oh, just uh, oh, I'm telling your uh, your friend not to drink expired milk. You know, that's oh, kind of yeah, it. Oh yeah, no, but you're pressing buttons. Do you need help using your phone machine? No, I'm I'm not I'm not pressing any buttons. Oh yeah, yeah, you've pressed many buttons. You pressed uh, three buttons so far by my count. Oh yeah, it uh, could just be something yeah. wrong with the phone then. I'm not sure. Well, no, I think it's something wrong because the expired milk. That was number one. Yeah. And now it's the buttons. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's, it seems to me like there's a lot of things wrong here. Yeah. Asshole. 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 Yeah, uh, yeah, I would, I would just make sure your friend doesn't drink any more uh, expired milk. Because um, that's kind of weird no, he that, found uh, it, he that he would drink expired milk. Like alcohol, you fucking, you fucking alcoholic. Yeah, like how <laughs> many are you in? How many? Uh, a few. A few in. Oh, well, that's a, uh, it is, I mean, it is a cold place, and it makes sense, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, almost, almost yeah. 10 p.m., gotta stay warm. Yeah. You know. Yeah, uh, well, the, the problem still stands, why is there chunky her? milk? Well, who's that? Um, you know, um, whether there's chunky milk, um, or not, just, I wouldn't drink it. 
So I want that's just a little ass on my face. If you Lay off if the you don't want to drink the if you want to drink the expired milk, go ahead. Um, but I, I personally would. It. Can I play with your balls? Uh, you cannot. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. I wasn't talking to you, bitch. I was talking to the other guy. Oh, uh, okay. Um, well, I'll, I'll let you guys uh, do that. And then, uh, like I said, just don't drink that expired milk. As as long as you, I'll let you play with my balls, as long as you know what our franchise is. No, yeah, I, I know what a franchise is. Yeah, are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, I, no, I, yeah, I'm yeah, sorry. Just, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm just sorry. don't drink the, the, the expired milk. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, it's okay. Um, I'm also sorry. I apologize okay, yeah. I, I for my previous yeah, no, actions. Yeah, it, it, it's okay. It's okay, no worries. I was I was inappropriate in my behavior, and that will never happen again. Okay. Yeah. No. Yeah. That's fine. No. No worries here. Do you, Do you want me to just like slip you thirty dollars or? Uh, no. You know, I'm just, uh, I'm just real bored. I'm I'm just real bored at work. You know, so just trying to keep this call going as long as I can. Okay. It's, it's, it's entertaining me a little bit. You know. Why? Uh, because there's nothing really here for me to do, so, you know. How about that weather, huh? Yeah, it's getting cold out there. That's for sure. Is it? Is this entertaining to you? What's up? Is is this entertaining stuff to you? Yeah, you don't get calls like this, long, you know. So just as long as long as somebody else doesn't call, because I'm because I'm not thinking of this one. Can you start talking about politics? Well, uh, I'm not really big on politics. Yeah, start talking about your political opinion. I think everyone here wants to hear it. Uh, I don't really have political appearance. Appearance? What the fuck is that? Yeah, I don't. I don't have a political opinion. You know, I'm not. I'm not too big on on politics. <laughs> what's your What's your opinion? Uh, were you begging your mom last night? Uh, I mean, as long as you guys both enjoyed it, that's all that matters. Yeah. She, she enjoyed every second. I didn't know yeah, they allow those little TVs good. at work. You're watching porn or something? What is that? What's that? I didn't know they allowed those little, like, box TVs at work. Are you a communist? Um, Say that again? I can't, I, I can't Tur- understand you. Turbo is telling me so, to mold you into a communist. Are you a communist? Yes. Okay, that's good. Ooh, Turbo, I think we got it. Damn, that was quick. You're good. Uh-huh. Are you ready to seize the means of production with me? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Me and Harold in the background, we're gonna seize we're gonna seize the means of production. Do do you wanna talk to Milkman? Yeah, yeah, whoever's fine. Milkman, are you there? Hey, how you doing, big boy? <laughs> this is, yeah, this is the milkman here, and I got a big old half gallon of butt milk here. 
is our special flavor here. Me and my brother developed. It's called Double Dutch Butt Milk. He gets really excited. Whatever he talk about that, let's not get all excited. <laughs> oh my goodness. See how excited he is. Quitch. Do you like to play slap and tickle? <laughs> I think he does. Do you like to play slap and tickle there, brother? Sir, have you ever made a stirring motion with your butthole to stir milk? <laughs> I bet you like this, to play gag your wrist. This is a delicate, hard process that we're going through to make this butt milk, okay? <laughs> You're churning. Sir, are you a sex pervert from America? I'm getting pervy vibes over the phone right now. I'd like to book a room. Sir, take a seat. Oh, well, Miriam wants to take a look at the Grand Canyon, if you know what I mean. <laughs> She's got a Grand Canyon. <laughs> Under you. her nappies. I should do a Grand Canyon. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hi. Hello? Hi, Vanessa. Hi. Uh, my grandma, she really wants to see the Great Canyon. And, you know, uh, it's hard to get her out of the house. So let me put her on. And I, we also have the rest of the family here because she's hard of, she has issues and she's being taken care of by the whole family. So just give me a moment. Are you wanting to make a reservation? Yeah, yeah. She has some questions. But let me let me see if I can get her. Here, just talk to uh, the kids for a minute here. Thanks. I don't want to go. It's okay, Grandma. Come on. We're going to go, okay? Come on, let's talk on the phone to them, all right? I don't want to. Hello? 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 Yes, hello. I have some questions about your, your facilities. Do you have a toilet that's made for the wheelchair? Sorry, what was that? A wheelchair. Accessible. Because I'm in a chair. I don't wear a diaper. And they won't take care of me. They want to take me to the Grand Canyon and throw me in. I don't want to go. Grandma, that's not, that's not it at all. Hello? Hello? Are you there? Hello? Oh, great. What What did you tell her? I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Well, we're going to throw you in there. What did you tell her? I don't want to go. Uh, hello? Hello? Hello?
not an 800. Green Tree in. My name's Daniel. How can I help? We want to know if we can get a room. Looking for a room tonight? Yes, sir. We need a room for goddamn tonight. Uh, we're actually all sold out tonight. Is there anything you can do? What room are you staying in? I'm I'm not staying in a room. I'm just an employee at the hotel. All right, well, you're going to have to be the one to tell my brother. He's going to be pissed. I'm not going to tell him you're going to do it because I don't want him mad at me. Elasma. Hello. This guy right here says that he don't want to give us a room. Why not? You ask me. He's on some shit. I don't know. You ask. Hello. Hi. Why can't we get a room? Yeah, why can't we get a room? We're actually all sold out of rooms tonight. Oh, that's a bunch of horse hockey. Uh, What what happened? Graduation. You're going to let us stay at your house then. You're going to let us stay at your house then. Yeah, you know anyone that has an open bedroom? I do not. Oh. This guy has an open relationship with his wife. We're going to go and stay at his house. Tell oh, you really? What. Yeah. Yeah, you going to come over? Yeah, what's the address so I can put it in the GPS? Yeah, yeah it we're going to come over. We're not going to come over. We're going to come street. somewhere else. Okay. Uh, Thank you for calling these in. When I first Milk replaced the butt Trump. Speaking. How can I help you? Hi, Anastasia. Hello, how can I help you? We want to get a room. For tonight? Yeah. Um, unfortunately, we're all sold out for tonight. God damn it. You're going to be the one to tell Elasma then, because he really needed a room. Elasma. Shit! Oh, I'm touching my organ. Can, I, can you call back later? Thank Hello? you for calling Susan on I-40. This is Anastasia oh, speaking. How can I help you? Thank God. Oh, thank God. You, you you answered. I'm sorry. I had a, a problem with my organ. Uh, what was that? I had a problem with the organ. I was pressing the button, and it was very loud, and it caused me to drive off the road. But we're okay now. That's why you shouldn't play music when you're driving. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, we were trying to get a room. Yeah, unfortunately, we're all sold out tonight. Oh, what happened? The the the, the <laughs> horses took over finally. You know, we've been telling and warning people for years the horses are going to take over eventually. You know, they don't like it when we ride them. And they're just going to take over. And they're going to take all the rooms first. You know. Hello. Hello. Can you hear me now? Hello, yes. Is this Ed? I got a missed call from you early this morning. Oh, um, are you looking for a motel room in Princeton? Why are you calling me? Yes, are you looking for a motel room? Can you hear me? Hello? I can't I can't really understand you. Are you looking for a motel? I I, I can't really hear you properly. I can't really understand you. Oh, okay. I can I you thought you were that? Are you looking for a motel? Can you can you repeat that? I, I couldn't understand you. Are you looking for a motel? Uh, where are you calling me from? From uh, Princeton, BC. Yes, I'm here. Do you want a motel? 
Yeah, where, where are you calling me from? Princeton. Where are you calling me from? From British Columbia. Okay. Uh, uh. Hello? Uh, what is the point of the phone call? Why are you calling me yeah, today? Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. I can't hear you. Sorry. 